Okay, now. Um, all right, now. So you're going to run into guys that are, that are that they're good uh, boot guys on top, guys that like claws, things like that. And what they're trying to do is they're going to try to create openings. All right, well, and wrestling a lot of times is opposite that, okay? When you think with just with me about wrestling, it's like, I know what I want, he knows what he wants, okay? So who is going to be the guy that doesn't let the other guy give what he wants, okay? And get and get what you want, right? So I, I get what I want, don't give him what he wants. Simple, right? Now guys might be stronger than us, things like that, they'll come out and they'll try to take what they want, right? And that's where our technique has to come in. We haven't done a wrestling move yet this afternoon, okay? I haven't gone over one move with you. Maybe a stand up a little bit, but you're gonna do that however you like to do it anyway, right? What we're talking about right now is position. We're talking about where I need to be, even against the strongest guys around. If you let the wrong guy get a boot in on you, okay? It's gonna be really, really hard to get it out, right? So we try, I try to emphasize a lot that not letting that boot in. We do a thing in our room, and, 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 and sometimes the wrestlers don't like it much, but, but it's just top guy, get a wrist or a boot. Right? And if the top guy gets a wrist or a boot, the bottom guy has to let him turn. Right? But the bottom guy is moving. The bottom guy's not like doing this. Three, turtle. Okay, we're not doing that. And I know sometimes it might be a way that guys like to do this sometimes. They come here. My problem is every time I've done something like that, okay, the guy has teed off on me on top. Manage to like knee me in the butt or whatever and try to open things up. I don't want that. Okay, I want to be dictating what's going on in the box. Okay, um, so uh, you want to make sure that you're not giving up position. One of the one of the uh, craziest ways I see guys giving up position to get a boot in or, or, or a wrist is when the top guy goes claw, right? And he kind of rolls, he starts rolling you around. As soon as he starts rolling you around, you think clown car. Okay? Or if there's some other way for you to think about it. All right? Because, you know, I'm not going to do it right now, but in between sessions, grab that great ball over there that's underneath that punching bag. Grab that heavy, grab that ball and, and just try to throw boots on it. Just on your own in between sessions. See if you can throw boots on that ball. Yeah, see? See if see, you see, point at that ball? Right? Yeah. Blazer almost got boots in on it. Nah. Right? So when you're on the bottom, when you know a guy is trying to open you up to get a boot in, you're going to make yourself into a ball, right? So blazer's on top, and ready, set, go, okay, right here, all right? He's, he's got the claw. All right, blazer, you ready? You go wherever you put your right here. Look at my knees. Look where my knees are, okay? My knees are here, right? I'm staying right here, compact, okay? Let's go back. Oop, just rolling back. Okay, right here. Now, as we start to go, as we start to go, if I can bring my knees to my chest before he gets me all locked in here like this, my knees to my chest, I'm gonna hip heist, push here, and try to jump outside. But watch this. This is the problem. If I leave this here, he's gonna grab it, all right? So my wrist is gonna leave. My elbow's in, but my wrist is going to leave here, right? Now, I'm good to go. Grab my wrist. I can't get my wrist, right? And I'm going to try to jump out of this pocket. Right? Um, what do you want to do here? What do you want to do? All right, now, this is where I want to be, right here. Okay, now. So all I did was I put myself in a ball, and then I jumped out of the pocket. But keeping the wrist free, okay, is a huge deal. All right, let's go here. This time I'm going to give Joey a couple openings. Oh, look at that. Oh. Right? Your coach is going nuts. Dude! Right? So now, no matter which way I go, he has a boot in. If I go back this way, he's got a boot in. If I go this way, he's got a boot in. All because I went dummy, okay? I just got, I, I needed to stay here. No boot here. No boot. Still a pretty good claw, which I'm not going to grab. See, oh, look at that. I'm not going to grab. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go elbow, try to get it down. I'm going to try to shear it down. Don't forget about this. Don't forget about this. You see, you see what I was talking about when I first started when I was just talking about this stuff? This is, 
This isn't any crazy technique, you guys, right? All it is is keeping my wrist away from you, right? If I don't like where his claw is, I use my elbow to bring it down, okay? That was a hip switch there. I changed my hip over to go this way. It just gave me a little more space. Okay, you guys don't understand that concept of going here with your knees, okay? And hiding your wrist. Right? If, you, if you learn to do that, you're gonna be really, really good on the bottom. Right? And you're gonna be that guy. It's gonna be like, I'm going down, okay? Five, five, uh, super 32 finals, I'm going down, okay? All right? I'm gonna make it six, five, I'm gonna get a takedown, make it eight, five. Okay. When it going away. You're not gonna be the guy that's like five five neutral. Okay? But it's just all these little things. You guys wanna see it again? Yeah. How do you do said no no? No. So he goes claw. Oh look at that. That's interesting. Okay, go back. Push me forward. All right, see how I just, I got a little, a little tough here. Got a little tough for him this time, right? All right, go ahead. I change here. Look at this, once again, elbow. This side I have trapped. I don't want him to travel over here. If my arm is out, he can travel. If I have it trapped, I'm okay. I'm all right here, okay? Don't give him my wrist. I'm not gonna give my wrist, but I'm gonna give him five. Okay, all right. So, I think we can work this right here. Um, top guy, after he does it a few times, maybe see if you can sneak a boot in on him. Okay, see if you can, see if you can climb in there, the boot. All right, one, two.